start with that breaking news in Lancaster County right now. We are showing you live pictures from Chopper 9 Sky Zoom of a police standoff in Lancaster County. Now deputies were responding to assist other police departments in the hunt for a murder suspect. Authorities tell us the person inside is Byron Watkins. He is the second suspect accused of killing a Monroe mother of five in front of her own children. Our Greg Suskin is on the ground there right now. And Greg, what are resources, are law enforcement pulling in? What are they telling you right now? Well, an incredible amount of resources here. Actually, I'm going to step out of the way real quick and let my photographer here push in down the street. We're at Highway 200 in Winterberry Lane. That is just south of the state line in Lancaster County. And you can't see much because it's all the way at the end of that dead end street and around the curve there. But there are literally dozens of officers. I'm told around 40 officers here. Want to go back up to show you live pictures from Chopper 9 Sky Zoom right now. Those officers, of course, from the Lancaster County Sheriff's Office, the Monroe Police Department, the Union County Sheriff's Office, and SLED has many agents here as well. And as you mentioned there, they're looking for Byron Watkins. He is the second suspect suspect in the murder of a Monroe woman that happened back on July 12th. The other suspect in that case, Antoine Sturdivant, has been arrested in Lancaster County. Got a message this morning from Monroe police that there were that they had a tip that this man Watkins was here. So Lancaster County was here to assist them. They surrounded the house, brought in people from several different agencies. Now I'm told so far that no one has seen him either inside the house or outside the house, but there was a report of a gunshot fired here earlier. That's why officers uh, are proceeding with caution. There's several Several robots that they've sent up close to the house to try to get a look inside. Uh, the last I heard, they have not had any contact with him and aren't sure where he is, but they also did set up a perimeter in this entire area as well. The sled helicopter has been up flying just to make sure that he didn't travel away from the house. Of course, we'll bring you updates as soon as we know more. We're live in Lancaster County. Greg Suskin, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.